I think there's a lot of, of situations um, that play into it. But I think, you know, we do have a lot of black women on this team. Um, we do have a, a lot of people that are from different areas. And unfortunately, you know, that, that bias does exist still today. And a lot of the people that are making those comments are being racist um, towards my teammates. And, um, you know, I'm in a unique situation where um, I see with myself, you know, I'll talk trash and I'll get a different reaction than if Angel talks trash. And so it, it's really up to me to, you know, uh, it's not up to me, but I have a duty to my teammates um, to have their back. Um, and obviously, you know, some of the words that were used in that article were very sad and upsetting. And, you know, I didn't really, I actually didn't want us to, to read the article before the game because hearing stuff like that, it's, it's not right. And it's not that type of description of us isn't always motivating. I think, you know, um, calling us basically the dirty debutantes, like, that's that's that has nothing to do with sports and that is not that's not motivating and so I think uh, I wish we hadn't have uh, read that because I think that that can crush your soul a little bit that someone would ever say that about us that doesn't know us but again you know obviously in my opinion I know for a fact that people see us differently because we do have a lot of black women on our team who have an attitude and and like to talk trash and you know people feel a way about it but at the end of the day I'm rocking with them because they don't let that change who they are and um, they stay true to themselves and so I'll have their back.